I was in a good mood. And then this book had to ruin it because literally... Son, can you maybe not be in my face? Okay, I'm just gonna sit back here. Yes, I don't have sheets on my bed, okay? It's a long story that I don't want to get into. And I'm too lazy. I've been laying on this bed for like three hours, maybe? I don't know. But it doesn't have sheets on it. But like, it's fine. It's fine. Like, I just took a shower. Hell, I just took a shower. I'm fine. But like, this book is driving me insane because there are these two girls and like they're sisters and like li like just when you're sisters or when you're close to someone like you don't like i don't know like it just infuriates me because like basically one of the sisters is very reserved and sweet and polite um <laughs> And then one of them is kind of a wildcat and, like, loves to mess around and, like, thinks she's all that. And, like, is kind of, like, mm. <sighs> and, um, they're sisters and they're incredibly close despite their differences. And the wildcat one is having an affair with this dude who's been married for five years, has, like, three kids, and like clearly is not gonna leave his wife but in her deluded mind she thinks that he's gonna eventually eventually being the operative word here leave his wife and three kids for her the side chick like sweetie you're delusional like that's just and then her what's her name her sister who's like all reserved and sweet is like telling her like this is not a healthy relationship, like, I'm trying to help you, like, you need to get out of it, like, clearly trying to help her sister, and her sister, with her insecurities, like, is, like, telling her that, like, she doesn't understand, blah, 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 like, you don't understand, blah, 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 bullshit, and, um, the, like, reserved sister is, like, trying to be sweet and nice and calm unlike the wildcat one and the wildcat one is just telling her like over and over again like you don't understand like <laughs> i've never heard a more pathetic excuse i've ever heard i'm like jesus sweetie like he doesn't love you if he's has a wife and three kids and hasn't left them like clearly like a man who is cheating on you cheating on his girlfriend with you or wife with you like clearly does not have the capability to love, like, if he believes in sharing like that. Like, that's just fucking ridiculous. Like, no. Like, mm, mm He either loves one of you or he doesn't love either of you. Like, it's just, like, not a thing, okay? Like, so, it just infuriates me. And then, like, what made it worse was she got in a fight with her sister about it and, like, because of her own insecurities and her relationship with those insecurities, she, like, revealed, like, something very, like, sensitive and, like, 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 a very deep, dark secret of her sister's and, like, it hurt her sister and she did it intentionally because she couldn't handle her own secure insecurities over her being in love with a fucking like, adulterer. Like, just, it's it's insane to me that someone who has a sister who's so sweet would, like, hurt them that way just because they're feeling insecure. Like, that is so heartless and, like, a bitch move. Like, and the fact that she's so delusioned that she thinks that this man, he's not even a man, he's a fucking coward, is, like, gonna sacrifice his family for her is ridiculous also they've been in a relationship for about a year now or a few months i don't know i don't really pay attention to how long they've been in a relationship and like in all that time he's never talked to his wife about it like didn't mention anything like honey like you're just a side piece of ass that he's using okay like he didn't even give a shit about you 
And he probably doesn't give a shit about his wife. He might give a shit about his kids. But, again, rich assholes don't generally care about that kind of shit. Like, so, like, it's just, like, are you kidding me? Like, it's, are you fucking kidding me? Like, and the fact that she's, like, hurting her relationship with her sister because of this asshole just drives me insane because where's your love where's your loyalty like are you seriously gonna put your loyalty with your insecurities in the same fucking area like it just just blows my mind and this isn't just in books like this is real life like people do this and like it's it's really bothers me <laughs> like really bothers me like anyways i keep talking about stuff that bothers me because like it's just what i'm thinking about surprisingly i'm in a good mood though so like i don't know like (laughs) um yeah but i don't know i just had to talk about it because like it really bothers me so like Clearly, I just automatically go to my fucking camera. Like, okay, like, whatever. Um, I just hope they, like, resolve their issues. And, like, the bitch apologizes to her damn sister. Because, like, that's just fucked up. Like, on so many levels. Like, who the fuck do you think you is? And how entitled do you think your fucking dumbass relationship is? Over your sister like over your sister really over your damn fucking sister you're gonna put this skimpy little pathetic relationship over your sister like that just blows my mind and i highly doubt she truly loves this dude i think it's mainly just that she thinks He's a great guy, and she thinks she can't get anyone better because of her insecurities. And so she's settling for this prick, and he's not even that great. And she thinks that, like, he needs her, she needs him, because, like, her insecurities are ruling her. And she's letting her insecurities in this skimpy-ass relationship rule her decisions, and therefore, like, hurting her sister. Like, are you just... (sighs) The fact that people let the, like control their like dang just just can't handle people like that like just ugh 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 cringe scoffing like I want to slap her in the fucking ass I mean face I don't know I said ass okay sorry but like maybe slight pansexual pervert surfacing but like i wouldn't even want her because like she's fucking like bitch and stupid and like what the actual fuck but (laughs) um maybe her sister because her sister's like really sweet and docile but like again they're characters like i don't know why i'm going into this (laughs) um yeah but like it just bothers me okay and like honestly you know fucking cares like who cares about something that bothers that person because like <laughs> it's just some like dumbass opinion but like it's honestly like a bit much for me because like i just cannot stand people like her like just they just like let their insecurities rule them and like hurt the people around them just because they think they're better than them or their dumbass relationships are better than them because of their insecurities, like, and it's purely because of their insecurities, and it's just, like, really? They're gonna destroy these, like, meaningful relationships for, what, your pride? Your ego? Like, really? (laughs) Anyways, I'm just gonna, like, stop talking, because, like, it gonna piss me off again so yeah we we shouldn't talk about this but like i just needed to like let the anger go a little bit and it actually hasn't gone at all but like it's nice to talk about it so like i did and we're done and like oh but like 
like I have nothing else to say because like I've made my point but like I'm still angry so I have a feeling like I want to continue this video but like honestly I'm just gonna like continue making like weird ass noises and just like staring off into the distance like anger like okay <laughs> um but like I'm just gonna stop this video now because like we don't want that like okay like way to confirm you're insane and get applied to an institute sweetie like wow um <laughs> um but i'm gonna continue reading because like i need to get over this part of the story and then move on and like hopefully something happens with those two sisters and they like like fucking like grow some balls sweetie like this wildcat is just bothering me and like the fact that she like would hurt her sweet reserved little sister is like i want to kill her like it's fine <laughs> i don't know about killing but like it pisses me off and i just want to put her in her place because she has no right to be hurting her sister like this and I think a lot of the reason why it bothers me so much is because, like, this isn't just a story. Like, this sh situation happens, like, with so many people because, like, people let their insecurities rule them. And, like, it's dumb. And I'm not going to pretend that I don't let my insecurities rule me, too, because, like, I do all the time. Like, you've seen me get caught up in my insecurities, okay? Like, I'm going to go pretend I don't. But, like... The fact that they're hurting other people because of their insecurities, like, bothers me because I hurt myself all the time because of my insecurities, but I can't handle hurting other people because of my insecurities. And the fact that other people let their insecurities allow them to hurt other people, like, just, eh? just um, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> So, yeah, I don't know. Just bother me. I've said that so so many times in this video it bothers me like mm, it bothers me like mm. like okay we get it sweetie like calm your ass down and i don't think that's possible but like mm, i'm never calm like i'm always like either upset excited like weirdly like angry or like i don't know like i'm never calm hardly ever like the amount of times i'm calm are like once in a blue moon like very, very, like, rare am I calm. <laughs> yeah, 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 okay. <laughs> Sorry, my grandma made me, um, make my bed, but look, it's all pink and, like, great. <laughs> um, ugh, ew, I hate pink, but it's what we have, so, yay. <sighs> okay, um, <sighs> Yeah, again, don't have anything else to say, so, like, goodbye. <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> that's it.